Hey, hello everybody, Max with Avon Website Pro, and today we're going to be talking about screens, like if you're using multiple screens, and their resolutions and how to set them up on Linux Mint. So right, what you see right now, I have uh, my desktop screen on one monitor, and if I switch the monitors, you can see this that this other monitor, I have my video recording software, well my desktop recording software, which is OSB Studio. So uh, I'm going to be switching back and forth between these two because one screen is 1920 by 1080. That's this one here. And the other screen is uh, 1366 by uh, 768. So let me go back to my, my main desktop screen, which is right here. And to get to these display settings, all I have to do is go out down here to the start menu and type in display. And then we could see that I we get the uh, the display menu. It'll pop up here in just a second. And here we have two uh, displays, and we could choose from them by clicking them right here. Okay, let me see if I can uh, zoom in on this for you so you can see a little bit better. Oh no. Nope. Okay, so anyway, if I choose my main display, laptop, EP1, I could click this one. That's this display that I'm on now. Now, if I click this one, uh, that's actually the other display. Let me show you. See this one here, okay? Because you could tell by um, the little green notification up here, Samsung Electric Company 23-inch screen. And then whenever I click over to the screen EDP one, and I'll click this laptop, you can see up here, laptop EDP one. Okay. So then that way you could tell which screen you're operating on. Now, I have this little display pop-up window in this one. Now notice if I want to change the resolution on this screen that I'm working on, this laptop EP one, I can change it here. Okay, now currently I'm working with this 3840. Now I could change screen resolution to this one right here, you know, 16.9. I could go this 4.3 screen resolution. Um, I could check out these different ones. Now usually the recommended one is the one to go with, all right? But if you're, you're finding things that are, you know, sometimes they're way too big, sometimes they're way too small, you know, you might want to change the resolution. Here's the refresh rate, 60 hertz. That's what's recommended. And it's the highest one on this particular machine. If I want to see the refresh rate for the Samsung, I just click this. And you can see that it's 59.79 hertz. And that's recommended for that particular one too. And mo uh, most computers will uh, they'll automatically detect your displays, okay? Now this uh, fractional scaling, you can turn it on. What or, or rotation? You really don't want rotation on because what that'll do is it'll turn your screen sideways. Okay, so uh, rotation, just leave it at normal. You don't want to rotate your screens; it makes it hard to see. And we could see that the same setting is on the laptop. So if we go to fractional scaling here, notice I have this set at 200% on the laptop because this screen is a lot smaller than this screen over here, which is a 23-inch screen. So we're going from a 20-inch a, a screen to a 23-inch screen, and so that's why I enable uh, fractional scaling on this one. Otherwise, it seems like the icons and everything get way too small on this one. Okay. Now there's other ways to adjust size of icons, but this is how we do it in the display. Okay. The user user interface scale, you can change this. Uh, you can make it uh, automatic, normal, or double. I have it set for normal on the laptop. If I go to my uh, uh, Samsung 23-inch uh, screen, I also have it set to normal. Okay. If you want to mirror displays, that means both displays would be showing the same thing you would tick this on okay and you do that there or here okay it, so i showed you how to detect the displays you 
you could click this button it'll show you the little uh, top on here but now let's say that you wanted to reverse these let's let's say that you wanted notice how I have laptop on the right but I have the Samsung on the left but if I wanted to reverse them all I have, would have to do is click and drag drag this one to there and now whenever I go to uh, from one screen to the other I'll be going off on to the other side okay I would also have to click apply for this to take place but I don't want that so I'm going to just put my laptop back over here or my uh, my monitor here and my laptop over here okay so that's we went over resolution uh, the refresh rate the rotation and then how we can uh, rearrange the displays the other thing that you if you get into trouble you could just click this reset to defaults and that'll take everything on your screens and reset them to the default settings okay here's the other uh, settings tab you can uh, disable automatic screen rotation by ticking that on and I have that and then enable fractional scaling which is still an experimental stage here in Linux Mint but I have that enabled too because it it makes my display uh, a lot better and a lot more workable as far as I'm concerned. Okay, so I hope that this uh, tutorial has been able to help you about you know, on your Linux Mint, how to set up your displays and get them uh, active. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please uh, comment in this video uh, or click the link in this video. Go to the post. And I'll see you in the next tutorial. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.